there, it's Linda here. Thanks for joining me today as I play with these goodies for Scrapbook Boutique. It was love at first sight when I saw this gorgeous Spellbinders die and stamp set and couldn't wait to play with it for my card today. So I've just cut myself a rectangular piece for my card front using one of the large MFT rectangle stitched dies and I'm laying out where everything is going to go on the card front. I've taken the black foam out of my Misty because this is a foam stamp, a red rubber foam and I'm just using my Memento Tuxedo Black to stamp it so that it will be all good for Copic colouring. You'll see I'm listing my Copic colours at the top as we work our way through. Colouring in rainbow order, just thought that would be nice and bright and happy for my card today. And I'll list all the colours at the top for you to check out. Three letters in each colour before we then move on to the next colour. Nothing too hard here, all pretty simple. I'll just let you watch the colouring and then I'll be back when it's time to get the ice cream cone sorted.
sentiment is all covered up there and it's time for the ice cream cone. I'm stamping the cone on the card front, that will be one layer. And then I'll be stamping it again, I think three times I end up, yes, there we go, three times and I will just colour certain parts of that, the cone and the ice cream each time, working out which ones I'll cut out with the dies and I also do some fussy cutting myself. And again, nothing too tricky here, just lots of Copic colouring, making the cone look as nice and bright and, and happy as I can. And I'll let you just watch the process. Pretty easy. Just watching me, you'll be able to work out what I'm doing as I add all the different layers here to this beautiful ice cream cone.